Amboy Crater is a national landmark located in the Mojave Desert out in San Bernardino County, California. It's located along the old Highway 66, which is now called the National Trails Highway. The monument has a nice uh, parking area with restrooms in the middle of the uh, lava flow beds. And uh, the whole crater is surrounded with these lava flows. Very picturesque. And there's a nice hiking trail from the, the parking area here all the way up to surrounding the uh, crater and all the way up to the top. From the uh, parking area is a nice ADA or handicap accessible trail up to this uh, viewing platform here where you can get a fairly good view of the uh, Amboy Crater. It's shaded, maybe a little bit exposed to the wind when it's windy, but you have to keep in mind that in the summer it'll get up over 120 degrees Fahrenheit here in this, this part of the desert. And uh, any bit of shade or protection is, is very valuable. And by a crater is a national monument, and it is illegal to collect uh, rocks or volcanic ash from the cinder cone. However, several hundred miles north is another cinder cone that is privately owned and part of a rock quarry. We are able to get in and collect small amounts of volcanic ash to use as a soil amendment. We are currently up on top of the cinder cone. Volcanic ash is different from black volcanic sand found on the beaches of Hawaii. Black sand has been ground up from solid volcanic lava flows and has been crystallized when formed. Volcanic ash cooled without being crystallized and breaks down faster than black sand, adding essential minerals to the soil. I like to call it nature's natural fertilizer. When Mount St. Helens erupted, in Oregon, it spread volcanic ash east to Minnesota and south to Texas. We recommend mixing one-third volcanic ash, one-third rich compost, and one-third perlite for a good drainage and healthy plant growth. It's also very beneficial if you're using show plants, but to put the black volcanic ash on top of the soil so you get a nice color contrast between the volcanic ash and your show plant. That is the rim of the volcano above us. Down where we are in this plateau it's all volcanic ash. Now keep in mind this is a rock quarry that's been bulldozed and sifted to remove any of the larger rocks. I hope this video helps you understand the use of volcanic ash as a soil amendment for your plants. It's nature's natural fertilizer and we want you to visit our online store and purchase some ash for your plant collection. You can find us at www.halling.com forward slash store forward slash volcanic underscore ash dot htm. We have packages that come in three different sizes. There's a 15 ounce bag with free shipping, a three pound bag with has $7 shipping, and a 10 bag pound bag with $13 shipping. If you like this video and you think others would be interested in viewing it, I can't stress enough to you to click on the thumbs up button below suggesting to YouTube they should promote this video to other plant lovers. Also, we are also publishing new and interesting videos about plants, and if you want to be informed when they are published, click on the subscribe button and you will be notified when they are released. Well, that's it for now. As we say at USC, fight on, fellow Trojans.